Hey guys, this is Developer Dude, and in this video, we are going to create this folder in our project. In the last, in the previous video, we have created this section, but in to create this folder section, so let's. get started create another section class name footer okay and create a div with class name section 7 create another div with class name first and create another div in it there's a lot of div in this footer and create a tag so here in this image we will keep the logo of the website this is this one so just paste the link here of the image and press the enter and now we have created that div now create another div with class name first mm -hmm. first one okay now create another div in it create span tag right in the app because we are Indians okay now create another div pan tag write their English because we are using English language okay now create and then create another class another div with the class name second okay so class name is second okay class name second create another div there and uh, write h4 tag Write their company, company, and create an anchor tag and write us for that link and write who we are. Who we are. So uh, simply we are just creating this writing company who we are. So just copy and paste the anchor tag there. But here I have posted the pasted the codes. So who we are blog carrier support fraud contact and another day for foodies. So here is this. Where are you for foodies for restaurant for enterprises for you? So, I have already pasted the codes for these sections, okay? And privacy term security sitemap. Now, we are going to write another HTML code for the this one section. Where are you? This one social link and these images. So, let's get started. Right here, create uh, another div with box name four with class name box four and uh, uh, write h4. Oh my god. Another mistake. H4 social. Oh yeah, social links. Okay. Now create another div, and in this div, in this div we have to put uh, the i tag for the icons. Create class. What is the class? So the class is fab fa facebook. Okay, now create another i tag dot fab. Okay, sorry. Create another i tag. Let's copy and paste the code. Control C and Control V. Another time, Control V and just change the Twitter and Instagram. So write here Twitter. Twitter. And here is the Instagram. Okay. Now create another not a div image in its tag and paste the source this one. So link social link as for tag and the icons we have already created and these images. So copy and paste this to so it is just control V and these two images are here with link. Now control save. Okay. Now let's check this out. Control tab. So here is our all HTML code which we have wrote which we have written okay these are the images here so now we are going to write this section this one so just get back to the code or HTML code and uh, write the HR tag okay so write the HR tag and create a P tag write and copy copyright it is for copyright and this and just copy and paste control c by developer group and 
customer category and save it controls I'll check this out okay now we have to design it so let's get to the CSS code and write this CSS code dot first wait first yeah now you can see that which particular section we are targeting okay it's easy to understand first image so width is to be 128 pixel and the height is 32 pixels okay now section 7 targeting section 7 heading is 40 pixels and uh, 120 pixels left right I don't clear is RGB 244 and 244 253 okay so the first class display flex and uh, just for content space between just for content space between control C check this out how it's how it is looking okay so this is here and I'll write code again targeting dot first one plus first one and display flex dot first one is 10 now we are targeting this 10 adding 10 pixels and border one pixel solid black border radius five pixel border radius five pixels margin right margin right twenty pixels and uh, font weight four hundred font weight four hundred okay Control save. Check this out. Control R, and here we design. Now, write code. Dot second. Targeting second class. And uh, display. Display flex is a common thing which everyone uses. Display flex. Just to write the space around. And margin thirty pixels. And zero. We got second targeting div. Okay, targeting div here with two hundred pixels. Okay, now targeting second class as for heading. Font width lighter. color RGB no, 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 not this one okay and white space no that control save control R so here it is how it is looking a bit of it same as the original one just Now write top second A to targeting under tag display line block okay and width 200 pixels margin bottom 7 pixels and white space no wrap white space no wrap text decoration none color equally and font size 0 0.9 RAM control save control R how it is looking Look. this is looking the same as the original the original site and we have to write the code so now 
127 pixels and uh, height 40 pixels 40 pixels margin top 11 pixels because of this pointer it doesn't matter and dot box for targeting dot box for so I'm not sure with the word we are targeting. So dot dot box four we are targeting here. Display flex and the flex direction column. Okay. So dot box four height. So we are targeting height tag. Now margin depth five pixels and uh, margin bottom five pixels. Okay, control save, control R, and here it is, same as the original one. So now we have to target this. So give it a class name third. Okay, control save. Now design it in CSS dot third. Dot third padding 10 pixels top to bottom and 0 for right and left. Color gray and font size 0 0.7 gram. Control save, control R. We can use this to design. Okay, now here it is our project which we have a full delivery site. So here is our project completed successfully. If you guys want to see the live view of our project which we have created, so the link is in the description. So you can click on the link and you can see you can see the project live view and there if you want the codes if you want these codes want to copy and these codes in text so you can download the file from github.com we will give you that link is in description you can check out the link is in description you can click on it and you will get the file our html file and also a css file so there you can learn more deeply and you can edit the codes and make it your personal website Thanks for watching this video and if you haven't subscribed to this YouTube channel then press the bell icon.